Hey, hey you. Have you ever wanted to grind for ticks in retro tower defense, but you're either bad at the game or you have no friends to grind ticks with you? Well, I got you. In this video, I'll be showing you how you can set up a macro so that you can grind overnight while you are asleep or just let it run whenever you're away from your home. Whatever the case is, you need ticks and I'll be showing you how you can get ticks really fast without being on your PC manually grinding for it. Now, for this method, we'll be using tiny tasks to do the macroing because this is probably one of the more reliable ones when it comes to recording your own macros and replaying them. So, uh, I'll link the site down below for the people who doesn't have tiny tasks so that they can download it. You just press this and yeah, that's it. Now, before you actually go record your macros, I recommend you change a couple of things before you record them. Otherwise, um, it's going to get a little bit weird and you don't really want these settings enabled when you're recording your macros. First of all, you want to go into preferences. It's this little icon over here. You want to turn on continuous playback. Otherwise, your macros will only play once and you don't really want that, especially if you're overnight grinding for ticks. And for playback hotkey, I recommend you uh, change it to Control shift alt p because... For some reason, Roblox has it for F12 where if you press it, you just automatically did, uh, record Roblox. And you don't really want to record Roblox overnight because, um, first of all, that would, that's just so much storage going to waste. And second of all, it's just annoying. After you turn on slash turn off some of the settings, you can go into any map that you want to grind in. I recommend you go on Crossroads, but it doesn't really matter because you'll be getting the same results. And it depends on what playstyle you have. And plus, um... You want to go into crossroads because it's actually really easy for you to grind on crossroads with the macro on because I'm going to be honest, the macro is good, but it isn't a perfect macro and the macro can sometimes have some inconsistencies. So I recommend you choose crossroads, but, but any map is fine. You can play perfectly. Now, after you go into the map of your choice, there's a couple of steps that you have to do before you start this, before you start uh, recording with the macro. Now, this is an important step. All you have to do is finding find a standing spot and zoom out because during the macro you cannot move your Roblox character slash your Roblox uh, camera as well because if you do the macro will record that right and it will replay it and then you'll just be like off of the center not placing down your units in the right place or just uh, completely uh, moving from a different spot where the zombies can leak and kill you. After you find your step like over here on crossroads where like after you can see most now after oh wait. Now, um, I actually recommend you first die. I'll explain that. Well, I'll explain right now. Okay, now you see the game over screen, right? Make sure your hands is away from your W, A, S, and D keys, and make sure you don't press right click. And just kind of, you just kind of press F8 and play again and then you prick on the difficulty and then you can actually start placing down your units now this is a macro it will record everything and you don't really have to necessarily follow what i do since this is a macro it does it, it records what you play so it doesn't necessarily have to be the same exact thing that i do now there's also a few things to keep in mind to make sure that the macro actually works like as intended uh, and consistently because remember this macro is great and all but it is not the perfect macro so it can't has inconsistencies but other than that that's you should just be able to just use your play style you do whatever you After you see this uh, game over screen, make sure you see like a menu of, of a unit. After you see this uh, game over screen slash win screen, uh, you can now close your macro and you can now press the replay keybinds, which is uh, shift control alt plus P. And now it should be able to uh, replay what you placed previously. If you have any questions about the macro, leave them in the comments down below or join my Discord because I'll be answering some questions there. Now, if your macro doesn't work or messes up when you replay it, I recommend you re-record your macro again and do it all over again and then keep replaying until you get your right result. But if you have any other questions, just leave them in the comment section and I'll try to answer them. 
anyways thank you guys so much for watching make sure to like and subscribe if you want more content like this and i'll be recording more uh retro tire defense uh videos soon but for now bye bye